if you watch YouTube videos, you'll see tens or perhaps hundreds of comparison reviews asking which is better, smart bulb or smart sweets. And most often, reviewers chose smart sweets. Why? When you replace ordinary bulb with smart bulb, but you are still using the ordinary wall sweets, chances are the sweets are kept in the on position the whole time so that the smart bulb stays online. Yeelight, a company in Xiaomi's ecosystem, has introduced flex suites to pair with their smart bulbs and making these bulbs online at all times, or they call it smart light is always on. Sometimes online sellers call these suites as atom suites. Join me in this video as I tried using flex switches in my home. Once again, I'm requesting you to subscribe to support this channel and click that notification bell. Yung switch namin sa bedroom sa amin dito sa bahay ay nasa labas. Ito siya. Dalawa. It's either this is unique or substandard. Thanks to our developer, Phil Invest, for... <laughs> having these switches installed outside the bedroom so it means kung mag-on o mag-off kami sa switch sa, sa bulb, kalabas kami wala sa kwarto para lang mga switch on o switch off ang bulb so ganun rin sa kabilang kwarto pag lalabas kami or uh, papasok we have to switch on the, the lights right on the, the wall switch na nasa labas ng kwarto but this other room, pinalitan ko actually ng smart bulb. This is a um, me light uh, bulb. So if I'll say turn on me lights. Sure, turning on four things. Now, if I'm going to turn off the switch, if you can see here, the switch is uh, permanently on. If I turn that off, simply off siya. And if I'll ask Google to turn it on, hey, turn on CJ room lights. Sorry, it looks like that device hasn't been set up yet. You can do that in assistant settings. So, hindi siya makikita ng Google sa system because the power was switched off. Ito ang problema. Pag gumamit tayo ng smart bulb, um, pinalitan natin yung ordinary bulb natin ng smart bulb, but we are not uh, replacing also the switches. Ginamit natin ang uh, ordinary switch pa rin. So, you have to turn that permanently para lang yung bulb ay may connection sa Wi-Fi or Bluetooth depending on what type of bulb na or smart bulb na ginagamit nyo. So in this case, this is a smart bulb. Kung naka-off ang switch doon, then this will not be connected to the Wi-Fi router. Ito, naka-turn on na. So we'll try it again. Turn on CG Room's light. Okay, turning the MI light on. So, you see, nakita na siya sa system ko. So, ang gagawin ko dito is to replace this ordinary light switch or wall switch with this kind of switch. This is designed for smart bulb. Ang tawag nito ay um, flex switch. Ang feature nito is uh, tinatawag na slash aon or slash on. Uh, it means... Uh, Switch light is always on. Okay? So, this is a flex switch. Para siyang push button kasi magbabounce back siya. Pag you, when you press that, babalik siya. Then also, babalik siya. Okay? Um, ang purpose niyan, pag uh, mag-turn on ka ng smart bulb, you just push the light and it will turn on. Pag gusto mo ng e-off, you just also switch back the, the wall switch and... Um, mag-turn mag off din siya. So, gano'n ang mangyayari. But, the bulb remains connected to the Wi-Fi router. Kasi hindi siya na-disconnected from the electrical power supply. Okay? So, when you're going to use this kind of switch, um, yung bulb natin ay palaging merong supply. So, it means na 
yung wifi system niya, yung wifi module sa loob ng bob ay nagko-connect pa rin doon sa um, ating uh, wifi router at sa ating system. And by the time you're going to turn it on via your phone or remotely by the app, by the Mi Home app, then pwede rin siyang ma-control through the phone. Kasi naka-on siya kahit pa naka-switch off dito ang uh, light, okay? When you replace this switch, ang problema lang natin kasi this is not our standard. This is a square uh, switch. Um, it needs a square box para lalagyan doon sa switch. So you have to replace the box inside with this kind of, uh, with this type of uh, switch. Tingnan natin, ito ang ordinary na box. Kung titingnan mo, hindi siya magkasya. Kung ganun ang itsura, meron siyang <laughs> excess sa gilid. At saka, yung, yung screw niya, hindi siya akma. Hindi siya fit. So, in other words, hindi talaga siya para, para dito. So, ang ginawa ko is bumili ako ng box na 86mm mula sa China para magamit ko for this uh, wall switch na flex. Um, meron din akong na-install na, na flex switch dito sa baba, sa my kitchen area ko. Although, this is uh, temporary. And ginamitan ko ay mga ordinary bulbs muna, LED bulbs. So, uh, hindi pa tapos itong kusina ko. Kaya, temporary lang ginamit ko is uh, ordinary bulb. But I'm planning to put the uh, Bluetooth mesh uh, bulb, yung down lights, ang gagamitin ko yan dyan. Kasi lalagyan ko ng kisame o ceiling yung kusina ko. What is good with this flex switch is you can also use this kind of switch as the an ordinary switch. Tingnan mo. Okay? Nag-go ng lights. Nag-go ng lights. Okay? Hindi siya nag-bounce back. Okay? So, we turn off and turn off the lights. Ang ginawa ko dyan, kasi sa loob nito, meron siyang adjustment, ang screw, so that you can either use the switch uh, for uh, smart bulb or for traditional bulb. So, dalawa ang purpose niya. Ititwist mo lang yung screw doon 90 degrees and it will uh, uh, change to flex or ordinary switch. So ito na, tinanggal ko yung cover niya. Madali lang naman tanggalin, okay? So ito yung sanabi ko na may uh, screw dito. You just twist that 90 degrees para magbago siya. So, so yun na, na-twist ko na. So you see? Pag ilagay mo siya, yung ulit tong, ano, uh, cover. See? Naging ordinary na siya na uh, switch. Yan, ang kabila, push. Okay. So, pwede mo maset. So, release natin ulit. Okay. So, bumalik siya. Balik natin. So, ganun lang kadali. Then, sa baba dito ng switch, meron siyang lock. If you, uh, for example, uh, mag-switch ka dyan, then you have to push this one, i-lock mo to, hindi na siya babalik. <laughs> okay? Naka-lock siya. Okay? So let's say, hindi siya nag-flex. -nag Naka-on siya palagi. Meaning, kung uh, gusto mo na hindi pa siya ma, ano, uh, somebody will not uh, turn the switch off, so i-lock mo dyan. Pwede din siya malock mo. Okay? So ito na siya. Nalagay ko na yung uh, square box, yung 86mm na box na fit para sa switch natin. Na... So ginamitan ko ito ng ano, pagbutas ito kasi rectangle to siya. Hanggang dito lang yung butas niya. Kasi rectangle yung box, yung orange box. So, ginawa natin square. Ginamitan ko lang ng uh, grinder. Siya. <laughs> Para hindi ma, no, ma-prevent natin ang biyak-biyak dito. Nasayang yung wall natin. But then, ginamitan ko rin ng chisel. Ito yung chisel. Okay. But, na-biyak dito. Hindi mo talaga ma-iiwasan yan pag mag-chisel ko. Gumamit din ako ng ano, drill, masonry drill para sa mga matitigas na bato. 
then ito ang gagamitan ko ito ng ano, wall putty para mag ano siya makover to ayan you can just repaint it so kung hindi niyo kaya yung ginawa ko dito maghahayaan lang kaya ng electrician or uh, sino may alam nito um, the whole time live ang wire na ito hindi ko pwedeng i-off yung uh, panel kasi wala na ko ng lights okay itong lights <laughs> So, I need light here in this area kasi uh, sikip kasi itong staircase so nasa madilim siya na area as I've said, this is the, the hottest area in my house <laughs> Okay? Then, by the way, hindi totoo na hindi kami nagsusot ng masa dito sa Cebu Nagsusot pa rin kami ng masa sa indoor Okay? Okay Ipapakita ko sa inyo yung wiring sa likod ng switch na ito Tingnan nyo para mga piece ma ma uh, familiar kayo Kung kikita niyo dyan, there, were, there are six uh, holes dyan. Those are terminals. So, mas ma ma maganda ang switch nito. Modern kasi. So, uh, ang gagawin niyo lang is uh, pasok niyo yung kable. Then, meron siyang uh, screw dito para pag-lock sa um, wire doon sa terminal niya. Okay. In this configuration, para to siya sa um SAS is on meaning uh, smart light is always on uh, configuration okay. so actually my labels to uh, this one is uh, let's say this is l2 and this is l l1 meaning light one or lamp one and lamp two and this also labeled as itong one ito is l2 one and this one is labeled as l1 two okay Meaning lamp 1, second terminal, this one naman is uh, lamp 2, terminal 2, okay? Ganon siya ang labeling niya. Now, um, again, this line is from the bulb, this one also is from the bulb. And nakita niyo itong white na jumper na ito. This white na jumper na ito is a hot line, okay? Hot line to siya, galing to siya mismo sa uh, supply line. So this is the other line na hot, okay? So hot yan. Ito again from the lamp. This wiring is for the again the uh, is on or the switch or the smart light is always on. Kung sakali gusto niyo na gagamitin tong flex switch na to for traditional lighting lang, then you have to transfer the wirings itong kable na to galing sa bulbs dito. Okay? Dito na siya. Okay? And the same thing, yung ano, uh, dyan pa rin siya, nakakonect yung supply line. So, ganun lang, simple siya. The flex switch, which is also known in China as atom switch, is capable of dual switching or yung tinatawag natin na three-way switch that allows us to turn on one lamp in two different locations like in staircase. Both modes, Lisa on and traditional switching, can use the flex switch for dual switching or three-way switching. This is shown here in the diagram on the manual. The smart bulb in this room is the 9W Mi Smart LED bulb essential, which is capable of 950 lumens of luminous flux or perceived visible light power. This smart bulb is easy to add and pair with the Mi Home app and will automatically appear on the Google Home app. On the other hand, the 8.5 watt bulb in this room is the Yeelight Smart LED Bulb 1S which has a lower luminous flux of 800 lumens. This is also easily paired with the Mi Home app but will not automatically appear on Google Home unless you already link your Yeelight account to Google Home. If not, you will be asked to log in to Yeelight using your existing Mi Home account after which Yeelight Bulb will appear on Google Home app. So ito na guys, subukan natin ang switch, turn on natin, so nag on na yan, then turn off natin ulit, so doon tayo sa kabilang kwarto, off siya, subukan natin, on, wala, again, Wala pa rin. Subukan natin dito sa Mi Home app na i-turn on yung 
bahag sa isang kwarto kung mag-ongol na siya. So, nag- I turn it on already at uh, ito na siya. You see? Naka-screen recording ako para makikita nyo ang transition ko sa switch on the Mi Home app. So, naka na yan but I switched that uh, on from uh, the Mi Home app. So, dito tayo sa switch. It turn off na din. Hindi nyo nakita. <laughs> on pa rin siya. I'll uh, turn it off again. I'll switch the flex switch. Itatagal ko. Ganun lang siya. The reason for this is that this bulb is the is a Mi bulb essential or Xiaomi bulb essential. Hindi ito siya Yi light. Kung titingnan mo sa Mi Home app, andito yung dalawa kong lights. Uh, Yi light, it is connected from the um, from the Yi light account, then also the Mi bulb. Uh, unahin natin yung Yi light. Sa Yi light, makikita mo dito nakalagay diyan mababasa mo yan flex switch so naka-on yan kasi when i enable the flex switch from the e-light app like appear rin siya dito sa e-light uh, sa, sa bulb sa control niya sa loob mismo ng uh, Mi Home app okay so ganun siya kung pupunta ka naman doon sa ano uh, actually sa e-light uh, dito rin siya Ah, uh, ito. Makikita mo rin dito, nakalagay din enable flex switch, so naka-enable na 'yan. Okay? So ito yung una ko i-enable yun sa e-light app mismo. Then later on, nag-appear na rin siya dito sa may uh, e-light sa loob ng uh, Mi Home app. Now, if you go to the Mi Light Bulb Essential, ito tingnan natin. Wala kang makikita dito na nakalagay na flex switch. So, hindi mo ma-enable ang flex switch. So, wala, wala siya. So, kaya nga, sabi ko, the Mi Bulb is not compatible with the flex switch. Kasi yung flex switch, for now, uh, para siyang siya sa e-light bulbs. Why am I emphasizing this? It is because e-light Uh, devices are marketed as um, Xiaomi products and you know Xiaomi sells so the interoperability between the two products between the two brands Xiaomi and Elite is not always there so kaya you should be aware of it para hindi kayo mapasubo okay so pinakita ko to sa inyo If you have questions, please comment it below and I will promptly reply to it. Promise. Do like this video and please subscribe to support this channel. Again, salamat. Ako si Jun Tariman, High Tech Tabay.